Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, how to ignore a test method in test ng. Let me answer. There are two ways, okay? Either to disable or ignore, both the questions are same, guys, okay? So there are two ways to ignore a test method. That is, uh, we can stop a particular test method from running by ignoring it. So what are the ways to ignore? Either you can specify this attribute that is enabled is equal to false, or you can specify this at the rate ignore annotation. How to specify any of these things in a practical way, I'm going to show you now. I'll switch to this Eclipse ID. Here in this particular class, there are two tests. I'll just uh, go to one of the tests. And beside this at the rate test annotation, I'll just provide a circular brackets. And inside the circular brackets, I'll provide enable is equal to false. Now, if I run this, only this particular test will run and this one already got ignored or disabled, okay? Now, uh, right click here. Either you can select run all from here or you can say run as a test ng test, both are same. Here only one test will run out of two tests, only one test is going to run. The second test is going to run. First test is going to get ignored because of this enabled is equal to false. You see only one test got run. So C1 test two only got executed. C1 test two got executed, but C1 test one didn't get executed. Now the next thing, next thing is, there's another way I told you, apart from this, there's another way that is you can specify this at the rate ignore annotation. The top of the test method, you can write at the rate ignore annotation for the mouse and import this at the rate ignore annotation from test ng. Now again run, only one test is going to run, that is the second test and first test is ignored, will be ignored, okay? Only one test got executed. That is C1 test 2 got executed, but uh, this one didn't get executed. Fine. So these are the ways. If I don't provide at the rate ignore or if I don't specify that enabled is equal to false, in that case, both the tests will run. Okay. Have run it using the run all. You'll see that both the tests will run. You see, two out of two tests got run. C1 test 1, C1 test 2 got executed. Okay. So this is how we can uh, ignore a test method from running in test engine. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.